Hi honeybees! I'm back with another vlog and today I will be sharing with you my hair transformation. It's been a long time since I've cut and dyed my hair so I'm a bit nervous and I'm so excited. I hope this goes well. And before anything else, let's pay tribute to my long and black hair. Let's go! So I'm here at the mall and I'm finding a salon for my haircut. I decided to cut my hair since it's so long now and the ends are kind of damaged and have a lot of split ends. So before bleaching, to minimize the damage, I decided to cut it. Now I'm at the salon and Sir Lyndon is washing my hair. My hair is now being cut by Sir J. I was getting nervous during this part because this is the first time that someone else will be cutting my bangs. Thank you Sir Lyndon and Sir Jay, I really love the haircut. Before we proceed, I would like to thank Wood Quirks for sending me these beautiful BTS inspired candles. And what's amazing is that these scents are inspired by BTS perfumes and each of them are curated and crafted with great attention and detail. I'm so happy I got the Jimin white shirt effect, Mr. Bucket Hat Jungkook, and Jin's sweater paws. I honestly love the smell. I'm so excited to use this when I relax and de-stress after dancing. Grab yours now while stocks last. DM them on Instagram or Shopee. So it's Tuesday today and this is the day that I will dye my hair. I haven't washed my hair for two days now because I've read that it's better not to wash your hair before bleaching so that the natural oils of my hair can protect my scalp. Disclaimer, I am risking my hair so this will either fail or succeed. I chose to do this at home since salon nowadays are very expensive and you know, we gotta pay the bills. <laughs> I've already bought everything that I need and I will show you everything throughout this process. I've invited one of my students to do my hair since I've noticed that she has a blonde hair for a long time now and I really love her hair and it's so nice for her to do this with me. So let me introduce Hannah! <laughs> so let's get started! We will now start with bleaching and I'm using the Sun Bright series bleaching powder and mix it with Ashley Shine Bio Organic Oxidant Cream 9% 30 volume. So Hannah is now applying bleach starting from the back part of my hair, leaving about an inch from the roots. She's just repeating this process again and again until she reached my bangs. And now she's covering it with aluminum foil so that it will lighten fast. We will now wait for 30 minutes.
And since we're tired of waiting and we're bored, it's TikTok time! After 30 minutes, I rinsed my hair thoroughly with water and then apply this conditioner for a minute and then rinse it again. This conditioner really helped my hair stay soft even after bleaching. She is now blow drying my hair and preparing for another bleaching session. Again, mixing another 100 grams of bleach with two bottles of oxidant cream. Applying bleach again on my hair but now including the roots. So we ran out of oxidant cream, that's why there are some areas that are still dark. But we can't give up now, so let's continue. After bleaching the second time, we will wait for another 30 minutes. So 5 minutes before rinsing, I decided to risk my eyebrows and bleach it. Please don't do this as this is very dangerous for your eyebrows and skin. But I still did this because my eyebrows are so black and thick and I don't think it will go well with my hair color. So fingers crossed that my eyebrows won't go away. <laughs> It's TikTok time! So this is the result of bleaching the second time around. So we're drying again my hair to prepare for the last step which is dyeing it with ash blonde and gray. So Hannah is mixing three hair dye colors, 10.11 very light intense ash blonde, 9.11 smoky silver ash, and 9.1 very light blonde. And since we ran out of developer, we only used one bottle of Ashley Shine by Organic Oxidant Cream. And again, apply it all over my hair. It's now becoming gray and I will proceed to my eyeballs again. And after 5 hours, we finished everything and oh, I forgot to mention that I only bought this, all of these for 600 pesos or 12 dollars. We have to wait again for 30 minutes and rinse it after. So here's what my hair looks like after rinsing. Are you ready? In 3, 2, 1. I know, I know, I know what you're thinking. We have failed, have succeeded. Because I was achieving for a gray ash blonde color but it turns out that we ran out of hair dye and bleach and 
we can't do anything about it now. So wait for part 2 and we will be fixing it. So this is the result. I know there are some areas that needed to be dyed with gray but we ran out of dime and hair dyes because we didn't expect that my hair is so 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 thick that we needed more hair dyes. <laughs> but we will dye again next week but no more bleaching so that my hair won't be damaged. So watch that out for part 2 on my next vlog. But for now, I'm happy with this result. It's better than I expected. Thank you again, Hana, for doing this. And watch out for my future dance covers with this hair. Bye, Annie Bees!